the last time you guys were there, what was the like the itinerary for the trip? What was it like? You get off the plane. The thing about Vegas is there's actually like kind of not an itinerary and that's what's like fun. But you just like bounce around and like half the crew might just go downstairs in the hotel and, and be degenerate gamblers and the other half might just like walk around and like Ryan went and got a massage like during half the day Sweet. and like <laughs> right, because that was a terrible representation of Vegas. Everybody has a great time. You no, gamble, you drink, you get massages. <laughs> gambling, no. gambling, Ryan's getting massages. <laughs> it's the most relaxing long. trip of my year, dude. It's great. <laughs> no, you can literally do whatever you want there. That's what I was Even saying. Even a spa so, day. So the thing about SEMA is the, the Ryan show. Ryan did a spa day. <laughs> 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 you know, a couple I of go us to Vegas went. for the salt floats. <laughs> uh, so the thing with SEMA is it, it takes up like the entire Las Vegas Convention Center and it's gigantic. So you can't physically see like you can't walk through all the different booths like in mm -hmm. one day. So it's just like, OK, you know, let's look at this place. You know, they have off road stuff. It'll take you a while. And it's mm -hmm. like, I am so overstimulated. I got to go do something else. I got to get out of here. Ken was all over simulated because he was on Molly. <laughs> <laughs> Ken, you should have specified. in the bathroom just freaking out. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that was the worst representation of Vegas I've ever heard. You're like, Dude, just no, all in all, just Ryan terrible. <laughs> <laughs> I might do that this year. I might do a spa day instead of lose less money. But no. I, oh, my we, God. That was funny. We went out. Normally, you go to SEMA. It's really fun. But you could walk all day and not even see a portion of it. So then you quit walking and you go to the casino and you go gamble and that is fun. And then normally you go out to dinner and then we either plan on going to a show or don't plan on going to a show and then end up going anyway. Nice. Find a show, go, stay there till about 2 a.m. And then you either come back and gamble like an idiot, which we all do, <laughs> or you go to bed like a smart guy. Uh, and then so the reason I got a massage is I woke up ridiculously hung over at because i was out till like 5 a.m mm -hmm. and all the breakfast places are closed so the only option to eat was like a philly cheesesteak so i go get a philly cheesesteak try to get not hung over and i walk by those little like mall massage things you know where they put you on the bench and then they oh this is where this is going you're <laughs> Yeah, I'm telling the massage You're story. Right. I gotta clear that up, dude. People are just getting together. You gotta clear the air. This is why Ryan sat down to clear the <laughs> massage that. story. Yeah, I gotta, we gotta know. I gotta know what I'm gonna do when I'm there. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so that when you really hung Justin's over. Like, so uh, where's notes. the best massages, Ryan? <laughs> Whichever one's nearest. <laughs> and so, no, I walked by and the sign was like 30 minutes for $30. It was the best deal in That's town. A pretty killer deal. Yes, I. Sat down, got a little massage, and felt great. Hangover gone. Unironically, did it help the hangover? <laughs> yes. No, definitely. It was great. 